I've loved every year so far, but this is my favorite. And I really love the fact that it's so varied. And you know, it's a really great, varied collection of work. I wanted the different types of art to sort of be interacting with each other. So I think part of the story is just that there's not one thing that you have to do or be. You know, I've had a rough couple of years, so um, I wanted something that would capture like something of resiliency and just constantly swimming upstream against all odds. I tried to put myself in the, the role of, of a transit rider sitting in a shelter. What would they like to see? What would I like to see? Well, I would like for people to take away some sort of feeling, um, usually something uplifting or a little happy or pleasant. There's a lot of chaos that surrounds us, but there's an underlying order to it, uh, a repetition. Uh, I feel like if we look closer and can find almost like a meditation in that. Well, we are helping to support the St. Louis artist community through this program, and I think it's really valuable. I was going on the website to look at more information and saw that the other Metro Skates uh, competition had opened, but then I saw that they were open to all ages this year, and I was like, oh my god. It was for Black History Month, and we were doing it on girls. I chose to look in this art book, and I saw cakes, and I was like, ooh, I should do this, because Almost everybody in the world likes cakes. For them to win something this huge, like an adult competition, to me, that's like what's going to hook them for life. In, in addition to the value that it provides to our transit riders, it helps the artist community here too. I just think it's just fantastic. I was floored when I was notified that I was uh, chosen as one of the winners. What I liked is as, a, as a, an observer to be interested in it that it's, a, it's such a picture that people like to take the time to kind of look at it and then let them wonder and think about whatever they want to do. It's mainly just like the color combinations really, like which color combinations go really well together and then I want to try those color combinations and then just kind of branches off from there and then I see what pieces I can do. This is actually the second time I've done something involving public art and this is definitely the most recognition and exposure I've received from it. So I'm really excited to, to be able to see it out and about and you know, to know that it's out there for everybody to enjoy. It's very rare that transit agencies do something like this, so we're pretty, we're pretty lucky in St. Louis to have this kind of support.